Welcome to Vatican 6. I'm your host, Titan. Let's get to it. A husband, father, grandfather, killed overnight in an auto plant. He would give you the shirt off his back. Tonight, her best friend is gone, just as he was beginning to get his life back together. Right now, GM's Orient Assembly has closed as investigators work to get to the bottom of what really happened inside the plant. The sheriff's office says two cleaning contractors got into a fight this morning around 1.30. Rod Maloney has been working this story all day for us. Rod, you spoke to the wife of the man who was killed. So out here at the Orient Assembly plant, they have about 1,250 employees. They work on an early first shift, which means it starts at 6 a.m. and goes to about 2 or 3 in the afternoon. But this incident between the cleaning crew happened a full 12 hours after production had stopped. Coming for a 50 year old male. About 1.30 this morning, Oakland County Sheriff's Office received the initial call for a man down inside the Orion Assembly plant. When officers got there, they found this man, 49 year old Gregory Robertson, lying on the floor bleeding from the head. They attempted CPR, but they could not revive him. Robertson worked for a third party cleaning crew, but they weren't working on bathrooms. They worked on robots and paint shops and the like. Greg's wife, Colette, has a family friend who worked with him. She called Colette and Colette immediately rushed to the plant. She went into the security office and found out that her husband had died at the hospital. I don't believe it. I'm just still in shock. She told Local 4 Greg had worked the overnight shift at the Orion Assembly plant for the past seven months, sometimes had minor issues with co-workers, but nothing like this. Very good guy. He would give you the shirt off his back. I mean, he's had some problems, and, and who hasn't, you know? But for the most part, he was a good guy. He, he, he's done some bad things. Um, he, he paid the price for it, and... He's been home the last two years and he's been doing such a good job. Family does not have funds for a funeral. They've started a GoFundMe page. In the meantime, when sheriff's deputies got to the Orion Assembly plant, they discovered that there were only a handful of people on this crew, and one of the crew members was over by the loading dock. They arrested him. He is now in the Oakland County Jail. The expectation is he could be facing murder charges, and there may be an arraignment as of tomorrow morning. As for the plant, it's sat idle today. They expect to reopen in the morning. Reporting live, Rod Maloney, Local 4. Okay. This is Vatican 6. I'm your host, Titan. Thank you for watching, and I'm gone.